I'm gonna show you how to add a donut chart to a PowerPoint slide using the Engage add-in. So first you just wanna make sure that you have the Engage tab selected, then click on Infographics, and you'll see Donuts. So if you click on that and click on Insert, it'll add the donut chart. And the donut chart is a great way to bring attention to a, a statistic, uh, like a percentage value, uh, that might otherwise get buried in a bullet point uh, along with other text. Uh, this way it lets you uh, draw attention to it. So there are a couple options. The first option, the first style option, uh, this is a second style option, and uh, there's a, another uh, style option over here. If you change the value over here uh, under fill value, uh, it automatically recalculates. Uh, so I'm gonna go back to the uh, first option and I can increase the thickness as well. And uh, I can also choose to uh, not show the percentage uh, value, which is the label. So I can turn that off. Uh, I'll leave that turned on. I can adjust the uh, font size if I wish here as well. Uh, and then finally, I can adjust the color. So there's a couple things you can do with uh, the donut chart. Uh, so I'm just gonna move this over a bit. And uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna control C, control V, I'm just gonna copy paste um, another uh, donut chart here. And uh, what I can do is when you click on the donut chart, you'll notice these two gears appear. This will reopen the uh, dialog window that we had over here that lets you uh, customize it. So in this case, I'm just gonna change the values um, and while I'm at it, I might even change the color. And uh, for this one, I'll go ahead and change the value as well. And uh, I'm gonna change the color this way. And uh, I'll close this. So you'll notice they're not really aligned. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna go uh, to the align shape option and I'm just gonna align middle and to make sure that they're evenly spaced out, I'm just under this spacing, I'm just gonna bring them a bit closer. And as I do that, um, not only does it bring them closer, but it makes it ensures that the distance between each one of these objects is the exact same. And uh, it works going the other way as well if I wanna make them bigger. Uh, so now that I have that done, uh, what I can do as well is I can just go to insert and insert a text box. So maybe we're gonna create like a, a quick slide with uh, three values. And um, what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna add a text box here for each criteria. So maybe this is, the first one was speed, the next one was customer satisfaction. And uh, finally, maybe the third criteria was, um, Mm. quality. Uh, so this is a really easy way to create a, a nice slide uh, using uh, donut charts and uh, bring attention to uh, different uh, statistics.